Hello again. Uh, in this section, I will be talking about the functioning of uh, the penis and the sexual arousal that happens uh, when a man is ready. Again, just to give you a couple of anecdotes, uh, I do get people who are extremely worried uh, when they you know, don't see an erect penis. Um, in, in typical clinical practice, uh, if the hardware doesn't work once or twice, uh, you know, men come uh, running with lots of doubts and questions. Uh, at the outset, uh, it will be useful to understand uh, that the, the main sexual organ uh, that both men and women have is actually the mind, the brain. So when signals go from the mind uh, that the sexual activity is enjoyable, the signals run through the spine into uh, the uh, penis area. The penis itself contains two little tube-like structures. Uh, you can imagine, you know, like two little balloons, uh, you know, which when filled up, uh, get uh, erect or upright. So the filling up is nothing but blood rushing into the penis. And then that is when men get the erection. When sexual activity continues, um, there is, uh, slight lubrication that happens uh, in, inside the penis and a drop or two of it, which is commonly called as pre-cum, uh, can come out. Some men uh, mistake it for semen and they are worried that you know, they have already had semen coming out, which is ejaculation. Uh, no, so pre-cum is, is the initial fluid that comes out uh, and it is only a few drops. Continuing with the sexual arousal, at the height of arousal, uh, there is a, a reflex uh, process which happens inside the man's body, also triggered in the mind, at which point uh, the white liquid called semen comes out. I've also had men uh, with a lot of uh, myths and misconceptions surrounding it. Uh, we will address the misconceptions about semen and what happens with losing semen, etc. in a separate video. But I would like to tell you that typically about half a spoon or a spoonful of the white liquid semen uh, comes out. Now, uh, you need to know the difference between semen and sperms. Sperms are not visible to the naked eye. We have millions of sperms that are produced with every ejaculate. And the semen is nothing but a vehicle to carry these millions of sperms which are inside the semen. So after ejaculation uh, or, or rather along with ejaculation, there is a sense of heightened pleasure um, which is called orgasm. Now, orgasm in men, sadly, is short-lived as compared to women, which you will see in a separate video, uh, is only a few seconds, about five to eight seconds. After uh, ejaculation and orgasm, uh, everything comes back to the normal resting stage. Now, this normal resting stage also varies with age. Uh, when men are young, they can get another erection pretty much quickly within a few minutes to within an hour. With age, uh, the so-called rest or resolution stage uh, can widen, can increase. So men who are over 65, uh, there is a rest stage which can go on for a few days. Um, you'll also uh, find it interesting to know that semen and sperms are continuously produced in a man's body and they can go on. There is no upper limit to uh, how long the production happens and this happens within the testis. So friends, I think uh, you, you've probably gathered a few uh, bits and bobs about how the hardware works for men. Thank you. Uh, when it comes to duration of uh, intercourse specifically. Um, again, there are lots of uh, myths. These are floated largely by 
uh, people watching porn and one needs to understand that uh, in pornography there is uh, editing that happens at various stages so one gets the impression that men are able to have intercourse for a long long time. Uh, from large studies we know that the typical duration of intercourse is between two to five minutes. Let me explain that quickly. So from the time of penetration to the time of ejaculation, uh, this is the time that we are talking about. So if a man ejaculates under two minutes, most or all of the time, we call it as early ejaculation or premature ejaculation. And you might find it useful and interesting to watch our video on premature ejaculation.